This was definitely a match that Sebastian Cage did not request. Huh. I can't imagine anyone that would. Uh, he's having second thoughts right now, JB. <laughs> he's <laughs> he's <laughs> I'm really sorry. Well, he's being sincere, JB. I mean, how will 747 take this? Everyone likes a hug every now and again. Well, maybe he might give him a hug back. Maybe 747 might turn into a giant, cuddly, monstry, monstrous teddy bear. Uh, who knows? Oh, well, oh. no, no, I was wrong. Well, I was wrong, and I will openly admit I was wrong. Well, Sebastian Cage, I hope you uh, enjoyed uh, the five seconds of breathing because you know, it's about to come to an end. Those chops can be heard back in my hometown in Detroit, Michigan. Wow. Why? Why? Swim across the ring like a rag doll. <laughs> Ah! What? Ah. 747 is beating ah. him down like 747 was Bob Probert. Back to old. There's a there's a Detroit Red Wings uh, a little uh, nod right there for you, good sir. Yes, sir. Beating him oh, down like he stole something. Probably even came to Chicago for a while. He did. He was a Blackhawk at one time. But I definitely think not even Bob Probert. The Red Wings legend, Chicago Blackhawks legend, would want to be hit by 747. Look at that. And then he takes flight. Oh, Jesus Just throwing him around like a bell of hay. Oh. Those this, fans are loving this. They hate Sebastian Cage. You took the words right out of my mouth, JB. This is a pro 747 crowd. Like Cage is trying to get out of that potty slam predicament. Throwing some kicks to the leg. I think that might be the first amount of offense that Sebastian has had all night. He's trying to chop him down. It's like seeing a man with a tiny little axe try to chop down one of those giant redwood trees in California. The axe just broke. The tree branch just swung and knocked the guy out. He sure did. He just palm healed him to the face and to the mat. And look at his chest. Sebastian's chest is beat red from those chops that he took earlier in the match in the corner. Wow. Well, every one of those chops is just literally caving in the chest cavity of Sebastian Cage. You know, the referee might have to stop this. The referee might have to stop this match before Sebastian is seriously hurt. Well, referee Dev is on call. He's tracking Sebastian Cage right now. Goes for the pin, two, and a kick out by Sebastian Cage. Shocked that he actually kicked out. Most human beings just lay there and go, okay, let's get this over with yeah. ASAP. I want to go home. I'm hurting. This is not fun. Who's got IV proof? I agree 100%. I would have stayed down. Wow. Shout out to Ivy Profit, by the way. One of the, the greatest things ever when you need it when you're hurting. Anyway. I'm an 800 milligram guy myself. There you go. Oh my God. Well, I think Sebastian Cage is a 1600 milligram guy after that one. <laughs> wow. And look at 747 just hovering over him. Well, oh, wow. 747 isn't done with Sebastian Cage. Cage made the mistake at the last show getting in the way of one monster 747. We learn the history of man that anytime you just, I don't know, step on the toe of a sleeping giant, the sleeping giant wakes up and is never a good ordeal in return. Wow. 
Gage responds back to the kick to the face in the corner. Once again, goes right back and kicking in the knees and the leg, trying to take down 747. He's using any lid possible. Sidewalk slam. That's Referee it. Dunn goes for the count. Two and a kick now. Somehow, Sebastian Cage is still in this match. I think JB 747 looks a little shocked himself. He's a little in disbelief. He is chopped and literally tried to cave in the chest of Sebastian Cage. That sidewalk slam literally put him through the ring. And yet, Sebastian Cage is still trying to fight back up. Got to give it to him. He's showing some heart here, if anything else. Oh, huge headbutt. I think one more move like that sidewalk slam, this match is over. Has to. There's no, any, any, any man would not have. Oh, the nice stand corrected. Sebastian Cage right now striking down on the leg once again. It's kind of been a, a sight that we've been seeing lately in this entire series of matches tonight. That knee comes into play for the big men. Goes back to that old theory. You can't see, you can't fight, you can't walk, you can't fight. Taking the legs away from the opponent tonight. That is the message. Just that all those kicks to the chest did nothing but anger. 747. A grizzly bear in the woods taking those claws to the chest. Ripping and tearing away a Sebastian Cage. Gorilla press slam on its way. No, Whoa, no. maybe he's gonna dunk him into the crowd. He dodged a bullet there. And 747 goes outside the ring. We're going to see Sebastian Cage fly. Flies in the air. Oh, my God, he's caught him. He dive, caught him. But he's caught. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. Gorilla press slammed into that hard wooden stairs. That ramp has no give. JB, the referee is at four. It might be smart for 747 to get back in the ring and just win via count out. Sebastian has kicked out of three or four maneuvers that we thought he would not kick out of. I think 747 should just roll in the ring and take the win by count out. But no, he's throwing him back in the ring. Well, that's not 747 style. 747 is all about doing the 187. Taking his opponents out with brutality. Yeah, he has definitely been brutal tonight. This has got to be it. There's no way to roll. No, and that's not a wow. kick out by Cage. That's a I'm not done yet by 747. Brutal. Note to self, do not park oh, in his parking space oh, nor eat his food. No. Okay. Well, that's my notes for tonight. Oh, Cage is going to not like. Oh, no. Cage fights off. Kick to the head of 747. Goes for a springboard. Oh, slam. That has to be it. One. And no, 747, still not done with him yet. Wow. And 747 telling the crowd, no, that is not it. I say note to self, never cross 747. Wow. Oh, Ghost slam coming up. When 747 hits that choke slam, oh, a reversal by Cage. Oh, 
Nope, never mind. Good night. That has to be it. One, two, three. Yeah. Good night, Irene. Good night. Punisher 747 gets the win. Look at this crowd. victory by 747 is what we call making a statement. He definitely made a statement. I don't know if it's a bad thing. He countered a couple of moves, but I don't think he was ever really into the match from the start. No. That's not a knock on Sebastian Cage. No, not at all. He was 747 was just that dominant tonight. thought about this match for months. Oh, you can tell. Ever since the Mega Rumble, he has wanted to put his hands around the neck of Sebastian Cage. I think Cage learned a very hard lesson tonight. Do not step on the toes of the giant known as the Monster 747. And look at him in the ring, soaking it up from these fans on the four-year anniversary show. The crowd's still into it. Square Circle Megastars is delivered tonight, and we're not even done. No, we still have the King of the Scramble match. We still have the Odyssey JPH versus David Ali the Savior. We still have the Battle of the Colossus with Ben Sill versus Carlo Tom. And we have the main event, the future Will Austin taking on the Cobra for the SCL Heavyweight Championship. We're going to send it down to the ring. Steve Kitten, take it away. 